rendezvous pitch maneuver. Didn't get to see that live, but this is some video taken on the station. Commander Mark Kelly flew to a point about 600 feet below the station before he sent the word through pilot Kinham to let the station crew members know that they could start taking photos and began flying the shuttle on a backflip at a rate of one degree per minute. While this backflip was being done, Commander Sergei Volkov and Flight Engineer Garrett Reisman were taking photos from the windows of the Russian Zvezda module, getting pictures of the shuttle's heat shield to send down to engineers on the ground to take a look at and look for any damage that might have occurred during launch. Volkov was using a an 800 millimeter camera that will give the teams on the ground up to an inch of resolution of discovery s surface, and Reisman was using a 400 millimeter camera that will get up to a three inch resolution. Those photos have actually already been downlinked to the ground, so they're available for analysis already. The entire maneuver, rendezvous pitch maneuver, lasted about eight minutes, but only about 90 seconds of the maneuver are really good for photos. This rendezvous pitch maneuver started at 12.09 p.m. Central Time and lasted until, excuse me, I'm sorry, the, it started at around 11.59 p.m. and lasted until about 12.09 p.m. Central Time. After this maneuver was complete, Commander Kelly then flew the station to a point about 310 feet in front of the station for the final approach, and then the shuttle docked with the space station at 1.03 p.m. Central Time. 